Minister, yesterday you indicated that the only people who oppose your government's hate speech laws are, quote, fringe commentators. But of the thousands of replies to your own government's public consultations, 73% were negative. And according to the last poll done on the subject, 65% of people oppose such laws. So is it not, in fact, your government that's endorsing the fringe position here? What I think is very clear, and this is coming from the significant amount of public consultation that we've had in the last four years, um, consultation that started back in 2018, is that there is a very clear group of minority people in this country who are simply targeted and who are being either victimised or harassed, assaulted, who are victims of hate speech and hate crime simply because of who they are. So that is very clear, that is based on fact, and that is also based on reports well, that we but have. Minister, with requests, that's, on, that's not if, what I asked. I, but, I, but I'm sorry, that's not what I asked. And also, I've gone through every single one of the, the consultation re, uh, responses. There were about 3,600 of them, and that's really not what they said. The vast majority of people said they don't want this. So uh, where are you getting the idea that there's public outcry for this other than government-paid NGOs? So that's incorrect to say that the vast majority of people don't want this. Um, I think even if you were to listen to the debate last night in the Shannad, uh, and certainly the debate in the Dáil, the vast majority of people do want this. But those it's are based... politicians. We're talking about the general public. Where's the where's the public? Okay. I can either for answer it? the question or, or not. But I mean, what I'm basing this on is very clear factual evidence. If you speak to Angarda Shiakana, there has been a 29 percent increase in hate crimes across this country. So while we don't have hate crime Re- recorded, legislation, recorded hate crimes. 